Harry's friends exposed Meg's nasty secrets. Harry branded nuts for getting married to Meghan. Meg and Prince Harry shocked the world when he decided to leave the United Kingdom for a better American life with Meghan Markle. One biography reveals that his friends thought he was crazy before that. Let's learn about the Duke of Sussex's friends calling him nuts for dating a star of Deal or No Deal. First, a bit of refresher is in order. In 2016, Harry began dating Markle secretly. He had recently split from model Cressida Bonas, and she was the star of Suits. The future Sussexes didn't make their public debut until the 2017 Invictus Games, and they got married not long thereafter in May 2018. According to a new book entitled Revenge, Meghan, Harry and the War Between the Windsors, biographer Tom Bauer regales an interesting story about Harry taking Markle to meet the lads. Harry invited 16 friends, mostly from Eton College, as well as their partners. The weekend was lively with banter and drinking. In an excerpt published in The Sun, Markle supposedly took exception to the off-color jokes. Bauer writes, their jokes, involving sexism, feminism, and transgender people, ricocheted around the living rooms and dining rooms, without hesitation, Meghan challenged every guest whose conversation contravened her values. Harry did not anticipate this reaction. He was looking forward to the conversation, but Markle's walkery as his friends called it killed all the joy. Bauer says, according to Harry's friends, again and again, she reprimanded them about the slightest inappropriate nuance. Nobody was exempt. Harry's friends thought Markle, lacked any sense of humor. Driving home after Sunday lunch, the texts pinged between the cars, OMG, what about her? said one. Harry must be effing nuts. Another part of the book discusses a second engagement. Harry's oldest friends on that occasion thought Markle behaved princessy for refusing to engage with Harry's friends. Whenever we see the sexist term princess used in a derogatory fashion, our alarms start to ring. We've encountered Bauer's expertise on numerous occasions. He once said Harry and Markle would rue the day they left the royal family. He also tried to stoke a rivalry between Markle and Camilla Parker Bowles. Bauer revealed Bowles calls Markle that minx. Prince Harry was stripped of his honorary military titles and royal patronage appointments, Buckingham Palace said on Friday, cementing the split between him and the royal family that opened up last year when he and his wife, Meghan, announced that they wanted to step back from their official duties. Meghan will also give up her patronage appointments, the palace said in a statement, noting that Queen Elizabeth II would parcel out the titles and appointments to other family members. The decision came after conversations between Harry, who now lives in California, and his grandmother, the Queen. In stepping away from the work of the royal family, the palace said of Harry and Meghan, it is not possible to continue with the responsibilities and duties that come with a life of public service. The announcement, which was widely expected, underscored the deep personal rupture between the family and Harry, who is sixth in line for the throne, that followed his fairy tale wedding to Meghan, an American actress, in May 2018. While we are saddened by their decision, the statement added, the Duke and Duchess remain much loved members of the family. Far from second thoughts, Harry and Meghan seem to have embraced their new lives. They moved into a palatial house in Montecito near Santa Barbara, California, struck lucrative programming deals with Netflix and Spotify, and are expanding their own family, which now includes a son, Archie Mountbatten Windsor, who is nearly two.